until A, I either get banned or B, somebody comes in here, which I'm sure like somebody out there probably will. And I really, really hope that I get that slew of comments like that I did before. Please, somebody just go for it because that was unbelievably awesome. And I just, see, that's the thing. When I put myself first and I don't put other people first and I say, I want to do improv, I want to do acting, I want to do comedy, like, that's you know, that's what I'm doing, like, that's what I'm doing, and I'll just go and go and go and go and go, and that's the way that it's always going to be, so if you think that banning me, even if you try to ban me from here, because I know that people in Kutztown are resilient, and they're trying to stop me, I'm trying to stop Scary Carrie, by the way, sign the petition if you want to get me stopped, please, I sub I'm telling you right now, get me, you know, you can do a good deed, you can have a good cause, you can get me stopped, you can do all of these things. You are very, you are resilient, you are awesome, you are doing a good thing if you are stopping what I am doing, okay? And we all know that, and I know that you told me that, and it's incredible because I know that everyone is doing such a good job at trying to stop me, and you are so resilient, and I am telling you, you just need to go on and on and on and on and on, and you just need to keep at it. You need to keep at it because that's what I did. That's what I did with my acting, that's what I did with my improv, that's what I do with my comedy. I keep going and going and going. And I keep saying and saying and saying over and over again that I am going to keep doing what I do best, which is this. I am great at talking. I am great at being controversial. I am great at making people laugh. I am great, which is what I got. And I'm so happy that I got it in the last one because that is exactly what I am doing now. And that is exactly what I'm going to do. And I know that people on this campus and I know that people back at Rustin High School, they always wanted me to do what they wanted me to do. And that is not what I am going to do because everything is about me in my life. You are not the queen or the king of my life. I am the ultimate ruler of my life. I am the goddess of my life. My life is a regime and I am the dictator of it. And that is the way that it will be. And it is not for any of you to tell me what I can and cannot do. It will never be for you to do because that's that's not what my life is. My life is not about you and it never will be. And that's the way that it always will be. And it's incredible because I've lived my entire life, so much of my life, thinking that everything in my life was there for other people, and that's not the way that it is. And while there are people in my life that should be there, and they should always be there for me, and they should always tell me that I am the best, and that I do great things like I would do for them in return, people that don't do that for me, and don't tell me that I am not good, and try to tear me down, and go behind my back, and act like they're a friend in my face, and then go behind my back, and, and talk about me, and call me scary Carrie, and say that I bend my head because I have had I had hydrocephalus from a traumatic brain injury, or I should say, from a pilocytic astrocytoma that was taken out of my head at 40 years old that was the size of an orange, and I had hydrocephalus as a result, and I had a shunt put in my head that now causes me to bend my head, and you know what? That is fine. That is okay. And you can go, and you can tell your brothers or your sisters or your friends or whatever you call them, and you can tell, you can talk about me, but it's not going to stop me from being me, and it's not going to stop me if you get me banned from somewhere or you tell me that I can't do something or that I can't I can't do this or you think that I, you're gonna have an influence on my life that's no way that it's not it's never ever gonna be that way it's always gonna be about me it's always gonna be about me that's the way that it's always gonna be my, my life is about me it's all about me it's not about you it's about me it's not it is it's all about me it's always going to be about me. That's the way that it is. It's not going to be about you. It's not going to be about how you're upset because I said something in a joke that you didn't like. Because you know what? I don't give a fuck. I don't give a flying fuck if you think that me saying that the girls that were out at Starbucks the other day were calling me Scary Carrie. And I said to them, I said, you know, it's funny that you want so much attention, but you know what? I don't really mind giving it to you, especially since you no longer get it from your dad. That's not an attack on you because you've been attacking me this whole time. And so I have the right to attack you. It's only a fair fight. I know that you want me to lie here and take it like I do during sex, but it's not the way that it's going to be. And I'm sorry. That's not the way that the world works. And speaking of sorry, I'm no longer going to apologize. Should I start reading the comments again? You're just my type completely insane, I know. Aren't I beautiful? I'm beautiful and insane and not basic. Isn't that amazing? 
for real. F R. You're hot. Listen, I'm saying this right now. I don't want to be one of those people that says that that picks apart your grammar and goes you are to your and like you know freaks the fuck out about that. But it really pisses me off. So if you're gonna want me to take you seriously and you're gonna make a valid argument on here, I do suggest that you use proper grammar because I have had people go and message me and say. And they would they would say these ridiculous things, obviously ridiculous statements. But if you're going to make insane statements, um, then could you at least spell things correctly? Um, one time, a guy spelled hypocrite like H I P O C R A T E, so basically like hypocrite or something. And it kind of reminded me of some kind of Greek god, you know what I mean? Um, so please don't do that. Please don't do that. Um, yeah. So you're hot. 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 George is my type completely insane for real. Wanna have a dysfunctional relationship with me? Um, I'm too pretty to have a dysfunctional relationship with a random guy on the internet. But I'm sure there's many more girls that would be willing to white women are the most submissive submissive species to ever exist. So I promise you'll find somebody like that. Hey, sorry. All right, that's all I wanted to say, but bye everyone.